Good morning and welcome to session 999 of your Aperture Science Enrichment Center Automated Testing Confinement. You should be feeling rested and refreshed after your forced hibernation period. As you rested, our patented amnesia introducing toxins has slowly burned away at your brain's recently connected neurons, making any fears or anxieties you might have from the horror and or agony of what you have previously experienced melt away into a viscous fluid which now resides in your upper spinal cord. Hide on the interruption. You probably don't remember much due to the brain chemicals. But a certain test subject managed to trigger a self-destruct sequence and destroy a large section of the facility. There's no need to worry. Testing will resume. Let's get back to the TTS informational nonsense. Remaining bodily fluids should be captured and immediately sent for analysis. Please pick up the handheld portal device to proceed. Good. You appear to have a basic understanding of how portals can move you through space. Please continue to the next area. To your left you will see a subcritical mass energy pellet. Please use your handheld portal device to direct the energy pellet into the high concentration electron dispersal unit. Please do not approach the 1600 megawatt positron energy orb. The positron radiation can cause brain hemorrhages, retinal boiling, internal microwave syndrome, minor lung explosions, and eventually death. test you have learned so far. Remember, green energy pellets will last indefinitely without outside intervention. This is a degree normal test run. The point of these tests is to restore power in powerless sections of the facility. You should keep in mind, however, that you are simply helping the army or massive failure. Please direct the energy pellet through the after science radiated flux rectangle. This test chamber is meant to measure your mind's capacity for object persistence. In other words, this chamber will test your ability to understand that energy pellets exist even when you cannot see them. Did you know, when an energy pellet passes through a portal, its lifespan is increased to a minimum of 6 seconds? It's true. It took you long enough to get here. And don't use the I'm more familiar with two portals excuse. Fun fact. You will not be able to complete this test chamber without the use of your parietal lobe. Duck. 
killing. We've left it intact for just such an occasion. During the previous test, our remote brain scans have our patterns consistent with the beast's animalistic desires. Please refrain from attempting intercourse with any of the testing elements, no matter how appealing they may be, as it will distract from the testing procedure. At Aperture Science, we care about the opinions of our employees. That's why we require every employee to donate part or all of their brain to the Aperture Science Opinion Extraction Center. a history of seizures or epilepsy, please refrain from looking at or standing near the hydromagnetic cube stability units. If you do not have a history of seizures or epilepsy, then you are in for a treat. Welcome to the difficult test scene. Please use caution when attempting to solve the following tests, as any impromptu or dim-witted attempt <laughs> Unforeseen injuries. They aren't really that difficult, but then again. This chamber is even as in the last one. Just follow the arrow. Oh wait, the arrows haven't been installed yet. Well, um, just be better at solving tests then. This repetition is making me want to murder something. Anyway, here's the next test chamber. Enjoy.